Out of the Storm Alert Center we go. David Carnes standing by. It sure is muggy out there right now, David. Uh, just a little bit. Yeah, that mugginess is going to be with us uh, all through the weekend, all through next week. We'll add in some showers and storms, and voila, you have summertime. Right now in Chattanooga, looking okay. No rain out there after the heavier rain earlier today. 78 degrees right now, but look at the dew point. 73 is ridiculously muggy air, and those winds out of the south not helping at all, continuing to bring that warm, humid air in. Whenever you have a dew point of 73, that is just sticky, sticky air. 78 Chattanooga, Dalton at 73, Fort Payne 70 degrees, uh, 82 the high today in Chattanooga, well below that average high of 90, but with the humidity as high as it is, it is just nasty. Tomorrow, we're going to get outdoors, get some work done, cut the grass. It's going to be okay temperature wise, but again, that humidity is going to be very high. We'll also be dealing with some scattered thunderstorms during mainly, I'm going to say, lunchtime through the afternoon. We'll see those scattered storms developing and moving through. We may see a couple developing a little bit earlier. I wouldn't be surprised, say 10 a.m. if you saw one or two popping up, but I think it'll be during the afternoon when we see most of the activity. We'll get to the mid to upper 80s. Again, it will be very, very muggy. If you are going to cut the grass or do some outdoor stuff, try to get it done as early in the morning as you can. That way you'll miss a lot of the humidity and you'll miss the thunderstorms as well. How muggy will it be as we move through the weekend? Those dew points are going to stay in the low 70s through Sunday and then Monday through next week. They'll stay right around 70 and that just means that the humidity is not going anywhere. So plan ahead, get everything done that you need to get done early in the morning or at least during the evening as some of the heat uh, takes a little bit of a break at least. Nothing on the radar imagery. We're looking good for tonight. No rain at all out there. It's our satellite and radar uh, showing all of the rain now to the south and it'll continue to move south. Vipercast showing through the overnight. Not too much going on, but as we move through our Saturday, this is even 8 o'clock in the morning on Saturday. A couple of showers approaching the plateau near Dunlap moving into the Sequatchie Valley. And then as we head on in the afternoon, this is about 2 or 3 o'clock, uh, some fairly strong storms. We may see one or two. This one indicating some extremely heavy rainfall. Uh, would not be surprised if we had a couple of these storms approaching severe levels, maybe some small hail, maybe some wind gusts in excess of 60 miles per hour. National Weather Service not calling for that, but with storms like this, when it's that muggy, with the atmosphere as unstable as it is, we need to be very watchful. And of course, we will do that. Clay Smith will be with you throughout the day tomorrow, making sure that you are staying safe. A uh, quick look at the evening hours of your Saturday. I think we're going to have some scattered showers uh, continuing on and off through the evening hours. This is 8 o'clock. Still a few of those showers out there that will last right into the overnight hours. This is about midnight heading into Sunday morning. Uh, the slow moving front to our west is going to continue to keep things cloudy, uh, very muggy through the day on Sunday. Might see one or two showers earlier in the day, but it's really going to be in the afternoon when we see those showers and thunderstorms flaring back up for your Sunday afternoon and we'll see those lingering into Sunday evening. A little bit of a break, but then as we move through the day on Monday, more showers and storms moving through. So uh, the rainfall could be heavy at times. Be aware of that, especially after the heavy rain that we just saw. Ground pretty saturated. Mostly cloudy overnight. We'll drop down to 72 degrees in Chattanooga. Uh, warming up to a nice balmy 88 degrees tomorrow afternoon. And then showers and storms likely really through Monday. And then we'll settle into this pattern of just warm, muggy air with a few pop-up showers and storms each day, Tuesday through Friday, Greg. Thank you.